Oh, hi, I'm Matilda and welcome to my channel. Today we'll be making some unicorn horn out of a pointy stick, like here. Uh, I will be using also some hot glue gun and some paints and you will be able to see what I'm using here. Yeah. So uh, let's see how it will go. All right, now we are diving into the new series of Artificer, where we'll craft various beautiful artifacts. So, here I'm presenting some tools that I could find useful for this project. Okay, so, first of all, I will need a pointy stick. Here is my stick, it's almost 50 cm long, about 19 inches. My fateful utility knife and a book's binder's bone. Because you never know when it will be useful. A hot glue gun with a lot of glue sticks. A jar of water, because it can be useful too especially when there's hot stuff around. Some paints that will be used to cover our unicorn horn. Don't forget to be cautious when using the hot glue gun or any kind of knife. Cross your fingers so there won't be any disasters. I'm starting to create the horn by making spiral motions while applying the hot glue on the stick. I started from the non-pointed side so I will be proficient enough when I come to make the pointy part. I did it this way because the bottom part will be covered with more glue in the future. So if something goes wrong, I can cover it with more glue. So here's more swirling, more adding glue and repeating. Coming back with my glue gun to shape the horn into the right swirling look. Oops. And disaster happened. So let's say, after some readjusting of my surroundings, I came back to swirling, adding more glue and repeating everything until I was satisfied with the shape of the horn. After this prolonged fight with hot glue, and after the horn was properly cooled down, let's get back to painting. It's pretty straightforward, at least the first layer. I used the golden ancient black like paint and covered this horn completely, in every crevice I've created with the hot glue gun. Then, switching to the lighter pink-like fairy dust glittering paint. I used a method known as dry brushing technique, which is painting with almost completely wiped away paint. This time, I try to avoid going into any crevices, so the dark gold will be seen after that. The next layer was made with the same method and switching into the lightest of my iridescent paint looking like pearl or light white. So, after the first layer of that, I saw that the horn doesn't have the right color, pale white with a glimmer of pink and gold. So I tried to cover it with another layer of this paint. And after this layer, I decided I need to go with a different approach, because the color isn't hitting just the right spot. So I opened white acrylic paint found somewhere in my closet and mixed it with the glimmering paint on the horn. 
I hit just the right color. Pale white, like bone, with iridescence, like I wanted. I was finally satisfied, so let's go to the final look. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, hit that like and subscribe button. Also, leave a comment. And see you next time. Bye bye.